Hi, it's me again. Here's another one I have lit. Uh, it's a near and dear, close to my heart. I call it the Cuss Building on Ballpark Drive. <clears throat> Cuss Building are many tortured souls that feed upon the energy of those who dare to enter it and live there. Your, uh, your very life seems bound in despair to be caged up like an animal, to be locked up like a prison where no one can help you escape. Or want ever want to help. It feeds on your fears and doubt. To lose in life, to be in debt to it, to go mad any given time, wanting to be free, to be made to feel needy, lower self esteem, and the endless desire for love and romance. It made you feel unwanted, wasted, unloved, and ugly. So hideous to form. So hideous to form that nobody can stand the sight of you. It draws blood. It diseases your body. It pours in your mind, your body, and your soul. It turns your creativity, your desire, your dreams, and goes and smash it. Smash it to dust and to pieces and turn you into something of darkness. It draws a person insane to death of madness. It desires you to, to be hidden, to be tucked away forever. Within these walls of torment of madness, it draws out any anger, sadness, madness within you and allow it to take control over your life and make it its own. It isolates you, it shames you, it disagrees you, disorganizes you from society and from family and friends. It feeds off your terror. It feeds off your nightmares. It made it real in your head, in your mind. Twisting reality to suit its purpose. Its purpose to draw you insane. At any given time of the day, we got the people who we trust, who care for us is our weapon against this curse. And in the cycle of terror that plague any tenant who claim regency within these walls of horrors, it will disgrace your will, disgrace your strength, your faith, your courage to fight it, your kindness to others and to yourself. It's unstoppable, and it's undeniable. It's created something darker within you. It robbed you from your greatness and robbed you from your joy. You've got to fight it, fight it with every ounce we have. Faith, courage, and goodness comes in every human soul, and that day you, you be finally be free, free from this curse of building on ballpark to lie. It's groans from one building to another. It's another corrupt its tenants. Slowly it craves its fear. It's in the darkness. The human have within these hearts, it craves its fear. It creates this loneliness in life in those who enter its walls. It supplies its torments with ladies, whores, 
who walks through the night with sex so hideous, who hides from the light, he supplies his tenants with Enos' desire for drugs, booze, sex. Enos' addiction as it tortures tenants. His power corrupt, manipulate, twist both the mind, body, and soul with this seed of darkness. Only the power of believing the faith of the Christ who save us from internal darkness and bring us to the light. Do we believe in our hearts, minds, and souls of Christ to bring of life, to bring the life of kingdom of heaven? Only the true, the righteous, and the peace and the confession of all your deepest, darkest desire that we kept hidden deep in our hearts, deep in our, our souls and our minds, and by them all down and forgive ourselves and forgive others and free ourselves and be father of the Lord. Learn from his teachings. Learn from his passion, his light. Learn his voice as he touched your heart, his soul, your soul, and be free.